Hi, in this session we will see how to use Dr. Watson in Windows XP Professional. Dr. Watson detects information about system and program failures and records the information in a log file. This happens in the event of a program error and Dr. Watson starts automatically. To open Dr. Watson, click Start, click Run, and type DRWTSN32 and then click OK. Here in the option box of Dr. Watson for Windows, you can change the log path where you would like to log all of the instructions during the occurrence of error. By default, this is on the All Users Application Data folder. Similarly, you can change the path of the crash temp location and then you can specify the number of instructions to be logged in before and after of the occurrence of the program error on a particular thread. You can choose the type of the dump you would like to get created in the crash dump directory and make sure you have the checkbox enabled against create crash dump file if you are providing the crash dump directory. For your information, Dr. Watson for Windows is a program error debugger that gathers information about your computer when an error occurs with a program. Technical support groups can use this information that Dr. Watson obtains and logs to diagnose a program error from this log file path and can give a solution for that. You can also have the option of creating the cache dump as I told you. These cache dumps are used by the programmer and they can load into a debugger to repro the steps for the error. So if Dr. Watson is running in the background and the program error occurs, Dr. Watson for Windows starts automatically and log all these errors along with the cache drum. Thanks for watching.